Hello, welcome to this session. We're going to continue talking about grammar and we're going to refer to the structure verb plus ing. As you know, that's the way to form the gerund. Now the gerund can be the subject of the sentence when the action is considered generically. For example, going to concerts is the best we can do on Sundays. Reading German is easier than speaking it. It can also be used as the complement of the verb. For example, my hobby is going swimming twice or three times a week. It's also used in short prohibitions as long as it's not followed by an object. For example, no smoking, no fishing. It is forbidden to smoke and to fish. It's always placed after prepositions with after any preposition which is not the preposition to. Here we have in the examples, as you can see, without, at, of. Touch your toes without bending your knees, without bending. He is good at singing jazz songs, at singing. She is thinking of going to Canada with us, okay, of going. Now, these here are a list of some of the most important verbs after which gerunds are placed. Let's see some examples. Listen carefully. She, he admitted stealing our computer. I avoid going to those dangerous places by myself. My son denied taking the money. I finished writing my letter but I didn't feel like going to the post office. I detest living in this dangerous neighborhood. They dislike doing homework before the exams start. She enjoyed dancing at that salsa place. Why did she give up traveling all around the world? Imagine going to that country by ourselves. That issue involved taking much care. I don't mind giving you a lift. He prevented leaving her alone. Why have they suggested staying here for the whole night? Okay, those are examples with this list of verbs. The following phrases can also be followed by a gerund. The expression can't stand, can't help, it's no use, it's no good, it's not worth or it's worth, look forward to and feel like. We can also use the gerund with the structure having plus past participle, having worked, having started, having stopped. Okay, for example, he denied having been there. Okay, so that's all for now. Thank you. Bye-bye.